Hi, I'm Phil, I'm a food and diet writer and welcome back to my lighter option series. In this episode I'm going to make a really easy apple and berry crumble. It's proof that you can have a sweet treat that's still healthy. This apple and berry crumble is a much healthier option. The apples and berries cram in loads of vitamins and soluble fibre and the oats give a fibre boost as well as being a slow release carbohydrate. Before you start, preheat the oven to gas mark for 180 degrees. So heat a pan over medium heat. Add four cooking apples and about five tablespoons of water. And leave that over a low heat for about five minutes until they begin to soften. While the apples are cooking, you can mix up the crumble. So mix together 150 grams of porridge oats. 50 grams plain flour and the same of caster sugar and 50 grams of low fat spread. This really helps cut down on the amount of fat that you'd normally get in a crumble. Give that a mix with your fingers until the texture is crumb like. Add one to two tablespoons of water just to help it form clusters. And now your crumble is ready to scatter over. This is a great pudding for winter months. It's perfect comfort food without all the calories and fat. Okay, now the crumble's ready to scatter over. Now the apples have started to soften and they're nicely cooked. Add in four tablespoons of honey and the mixed berries. Just heat that through for a few minutes so it takes less time to cook in the oven. For the full list of ingredients, have a look at the description box. Once the berries have warmed through, just spoon it into your dish. Spread it evenly. And then scatter over the crumble. You can make this with any of your favourite fruits. Summer berries are perfect. Pears, peaches, whatever takes you fancy. Once you've scattered all the crumble over, it's ready to bake in the oven for about 25 minutes until golden brown. If you're looking for more healthy desserts and guilt-free treats, just click on the subscribe button. Once the crumble's baked for 25 minutes, it'll be pale golden and crunchy and ready to serve. Makes four generous portions, each with two portions of fruit. So there you have my apple and berry crumble, great serve with a scoop of low-fat ice cream. This is the last in the series, I hope you've enjoyed it and have been inspired to cook some really great healthy dishes at home.